Welcome back to the Java tutorial. Today we're going to be asking a user for three numbers and we're going to print the smallest one. So if they enter two, eight, and one, we're printing one because that's the smallest. I have a scanner object to get user input and I have java.util scanner imported. So first we're going to need like some actual variables. We're going to say int x equals scanner dot next int. Here we're defining a variable x of type integer and asking the user for an integer so we can store it inside of x. So we're going to need to do this three times because we're going to have three variables or three numbers. Do int x, int y, and then int z. We're going to have one more integer variable. We'll call it smallest. And we're going to leave this variable undefined because we're going to use it later. Now that we have user input, we can actually start using like an if, else if, and an else statement to actually check which one is the smallest. So we could say if x less than y, and we're going to use an ampersand, which means and x less than z if both of these are like both of these have to be true for the code under it to execute if both of those are true that means smallest is going to be equal to x but we could say else if if that's not the case there could be another condition then here we'll test for y see if y is the smallest we'd say y less than x and percent and y less than z if both of these are true, then the code under it will execute, which would mean the smallest would be equal to y. But if that's not the case, there's only one other case it could be. If x is not the smallest and y is not the smallest, then the smallest has to be z because we're like we're literally out of options. And then we can set the smallest equal to z. And then once we're out of like these like curly brackets, we can actually print. We can actually print the smallest. We could say this out and print uh, we'll say we'll say smallest number and then we'll do plus our smallest variable and let's actually do a test run let's do 25 10 852 and the smallest number would be 10 Let's do one, two, three. Smallest is one. Let's do some big numbers. Let's do 2023, 1999, my birthday, and then 209, my area code. And the smallest would be 209. And it looks like we're done. Let me zoom it out so you can see the whole code. And if this helped in any way, just leave a like and subscribe.